Are you looking for the best bee house? I showed y'all this one right here before and I want to give you guys an update on it because this thing is trash. And I'm going to give you guys a different one that I think might work better or at least some links down in the description to some other good ones that look good to me. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that I like, use, and have and, well, things that just suck too. <laughs> so if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button. So I did a video of this, kind of more of a unboxing almost, uh, just I bought this for my wife for Easter and I wanted to show you guys what it is. It's a little bee house. It's got a shape to it and then they have all these bamboo sticks in there and the bees fly into there and they make whatever they make in there and they kind of live in there. And it's just to kind of get, get, bring some pollinators to your garden if you're into gardening. Well, we left this out in the rain. We left it out in the elements so that uh, we kind of test it out and see if it, how it performs. Well, I didn't even actually get a chance to hang this. And uh, whenever I came to, uh, whenever I saw it the next time, I saw it was on the ground. And this whole piece right here just fell apart. I don't know if the glue came undone or what. Uh, all the a lot of bamboo stakes came missing. Uh, they're not sticking together. I can simply I can wiggle all of these, almost pull them out. Um, and so this thing, this design, I like the look of it, but the functionality of it is horrible, and I cannot recommend it. So I got interested. I got this at Target, and I was like, let me just go on their website and see what other people are saying about it. And there was three other reviews of the same of, of uh, the same product with people having the exact same problem. The whole thing just falling apart and coming unglued. So bunch of one star ratings on this. Cannot recommend it. In fact, I recommend I'm gonna test test this one out now. But I think this design is going to be something a lot better. I did an unboxing of this. We haven't actually put it to the test yet. But what I like about this is that to help protect it from the elements is it's got this metal uh, roof on it, which I think is going to hopefully, hopefully hold better together. And it's actually nailed in. It's not glued in like this one was. So... We're gonna test this one out. I'll do a review of it once I'll do a review of it once we get this thing kind of up and running. And I'll link it up down in the description below if you guys want to check it out. Y'all can go read other people's reviews about it. See, this is a case where reviews are very, very vital because they'll tell you if it falls apart like this one did, or if it actually kept its shape and the roof actually worked on it. That's what I'm kind of curious to know about this one. So, like I said, I'll do a follow-up review on it. If you guys want to kind of get a head start look at it, the link is down in the description. Y'all can go read other people's reviews. Don't just take my word for it. But so far, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of liking this one. We're going to see how it works out. If you guys are looking for other gardening things, I'll put some videos right there on the screen. If you guys are interested in that, you can click one of those videos. I'll see y'all in those videos. Thank you, dads, for watching. That thumbs up is always appreciated, and dad out.